back to my channel. Today I wanted to do another makeup tutorial for you and in this one I wanted to play with lots of color and I wanted to use some colors I don't normally wear and I don't really wear pinks on my eyes but I created this look and I actually really love how it turned out. I used a lot of products that I got from this month's BoxyCharm. This is a beauty monthly subscription. I have been receiving these boxes for almost two years now and I love them. It's like one of my favorite beauty subscriptions. It comes with all full size products and the products that came in this box were bomb.com. So I used all of them. And if you wanted to see how I created this look, then keep on watching. In this month's BoxyCharm, I got the South Main Under Eye Gels. This helps reduce puffiness, reduces dark circles, and moisturizes under the eye area. And you can leave these on for 30 minutes, so you can put these on and wear them while you do your makeup. Next, I'm going to play with the BoxyCharm and Pure Eyeshadow Palette. The first color I'm going to use is Pure Fit Eyeshadow, and I'm just patting this underneath my brow for a highlight. Now I'm going to take this angled eyeshadow brush that came in my box and I'm taking this eyeshadow called Nikki. It's kind of a bright orange color and I'm just sweeping this in my crease for a transition color. Now I'm going to use my Morphe 25D Oh Boy eyeshadow palette and I'm taking this kind of warm brown, sweeping this in my crease to add more depth and definition to my lid. I'm going to start to smoke out my eyes with Duet Eyeshadow and I'm taking this shadow brush from the Vintage Cosmetic Company and I'm just applying the shadow in the inner and outer corner of my lid to create a halo eye. And then I'm going to take an angled eyeshadow brush just to blend out those edges in my crease. Now I'm going to cut my crease with a mixture of eyeshadow primer and concealer and I'm just using a flat concealer brush and starting to carve out areas in my crease and then patting a little bit of this mixture on my lid and blending it out with my finger to buff out those edges. For a pop of color, I'm going to use Bay Eyeshadow and this is a really pretty frosty pink and I'm just patting it on top of that primer and concealer that I patted on my lid with a flat concealer brush. I'm just going to remove my eye gel since they've been sitting for a bit and I'm just gonna pat in any excess product left over from the gel. This is a mascara that I got in this month's box. This is from Butter London and this is the Double Decker Lashes Mascara. It has a nice thick brush and it's supposed to make your lashes thicker and increase lash curl. Of course, I'm going to apply a pair of falsies, so I decided to switch it up and use my favorite pair from Time Los Angeles in the style Extra. Moving on to my complexion, I'm prepping my skin with the Too Faced Hangover Plenishing Face Primer. Since my face, especially on my cheeks, is dry, this will help prep and hydrate my skin. I've been loving the LA Girl Pro Matte Liquid Foundation. I'm actually mixing two colors together because I haven't found one that matches me right now, but I'm sure during summertime I'll use the darker color and I'm just going to apply this with a paddle brush from Crown. To brighten underneath my eyes, I'm taking the Pixi Pat Away Concealer Base in the color Nude, which is my favorite, and blending out with a beauty blender. And then I'm just going to set my makeup with the No Filter Finishing Powder from NYX. I'm going to finish up underneath my eyes. I'm taking the smudger brush and using my favorite shadow from the palette called BFF. I thought this would be a perfect pop of color and I'm just going to smudge this underneath and then blend it out with a fluffy eyeshadow brush to get rid of any harsh edges. Then I'm going to add a little shimmer and brighten up my inner corners of my eyes with squad eyeshadow and a small eyeshadow brush. Then last but not least, I'm going to apply a few coats of mascara to my bottom lashes. With this brush, I like to turn the brush to the side and use the very tips to define and separate my lashes. Next, I'm just adding some color to my complexion with the Benefit Hula Bronzer. I'm applying this to my temples, all of my cheeks, and underneath my jaw. Then I'm going to define my cheekbones with a contour color from NYX Cosmetics. I got the cutest blush from Pretty Vulgar in this month's box. It's called Prim Vixen, and this is just going to add a pop of color on my cheeks. 
Now I'm applying my favorite highlighter from Ofra, and I'm just popping this to the tops of my cheekbones, side of my nose, and also on my cupid's bow. Now I'm just going to outline and define my lips with the Slide On Glide On Lip Pencil from NYX. And then I'm going to add one of my favorite colors in Peanut Brittle. This is the Intense Butter Gloss for a nice kind of subtle nude lip to go with this eye look. Last but not least, I'm going to set my makeup with this CoverGirl Setting Spray, which I've totally been loving. It smells so good. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I will list all the products I use down below, and you can also check out the link I have down below if you want to get a monthly subscription for yourself from BoxyCharm. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.